get your arms around me. I'll be a little vegan. All right, you know, we'll talk about what we're going to do today, but here's the question. Who are we under attack by? Having a good time for all down day, huh? Man, this is a beautiful sight tonight, man. It's like a county fair on steroids, baby. Well, I hope y'all had a good night with everybody the past two nights. It looks like y'all have, like I said before. 
We gonna do, we gonna do some country shit. We gonna do some soft rock shit. We gonna do some hard rock shit. We gonna do some rap shit. We gonna do all kind of shit, baby. Kind of shit. I wanna say thanks to everybody for showing up and making this possible for the people like us to do this kind of music. Now let's get on with this shit and have a damn good time. How about that? This next one is called Don't Ever Die because that's what our people do is Don't Ever Die, baby. Let's go. different folks out here man I love seeing the Confederate flags everywhere I love people knowing their history and I love people knowing what now this next one is about going through life and look when you go through life you're gonna get dents and dings shit's gonna happen but you know what you just gotta patch it and keep going that's what this next one's about this is called if I was a truck here we go you remember that picture bro yeah I see you, big dog. Well, ain't no insurance for a broke heart string. If your heart was a door, guess I'm out by key. Good it while I'm loud, you know it ain't me. Tender ain't up in a ditch with some dancing days. And we start. Even if I did, no 
I know a lot of other artists can attest to this. Y'all are the greatest, most loyal, fucking down for whatever group of music listeners that I've ever seen in my fucking 33 years on earth, dude. Slow to God. It's on some damn tribe shit around here, son. I love it. I love it. Wouldn't trade it for nothing, y'all. Now, this next one, man, this next one is, I wrote this one night. I was like, man. What do I want to be for music when it's said and done? When Upchurch says his last stupid ass thing, when Upchurch has his last gray hair, the last time he fucking bitches at the mailman, what do I want to be in the future, man? And this is, and this is what this song is about. This song is what I want to be for y'all in the future eventually. It's called Wine and Crystal. It's yeah. off the concert with Cricket Town. Here we go. Try to cut me down like my legs, man. 
song and give me a reason to write it really i really do believe we are gonna be a bottle of wine one day boy when you open that motherfucker it's gonna get it's gonna get music history drunk as shit dude it's worth god it's gonna taste good too how many folks i got in here still listen to the good stuff like the old shit you know what i mean How many of y'all still take a little bit of a little bit of shrooms, walk around the house, listen to uh, Fleetwood Mac or some shit? Yeah. So this next one, it's along the lines of some Fleetwood Mac shit. I was sitting down one day and I was, you know, smoking some giggle grass or whatever, and uh, and I was like, man, I want to write a song about these festivals, about these shows, but I want to explain it without using any humans, without using any of that. I just want to use weather and the fucking ground that us country folk run wild on all the time. And I called this mug Honeysuckles in Rain. Yeah. And if you know, you know how you have a memory and you smell something and you're like, man, this takes me back to a specific place, a specific season and all that. So Honeysuckles in Rain to me will always be these festivals with all these faces in slow motion to me. That's how I feel. And that's what, that's what that smell brings to me is these memories that we're making along the way as we go. And this one's called Honey Suckles and Rain. It's off a new Creeper 3 album. Here we go. I love you too, Skin. Get in church, bud! Summer memories 
Appreciate it. Hey man, how many of y'all, I don't know, that was a pretty dumb ass skip, bro. Remember back in the day, I just had this random thought. Dude, I remember one time I grabbed a fucking old curd jar, old mason jar. I told my grandpa, I said, bro, I'm going outside. He's like, what are you doing? I said, I'm finna go get a whole jug of honeysuckle drips. He's like, hell, you gonna do that? Bro, I was out there, I was a kid, I was like fucking five hours, didn't get shit. The drips I was getting was evaporating with the sun. I was like, damn. The times that we live in now, man. It seems like that's the same stupidity going on, but I was for then, so, you know. There's a lot of crazy shit going on right now, man. And I just want to let everybody know that this is my personal thought on on how, how we should be thinking right now. And this is all seriousness, man. Fuck all the bullshit. Fuck all the conspiracy theory shit. Fuck all the politics, man. The politics is I'm fucking against politics. I'm for the people on the fucking ground. I'm for the people on the back roads. I'm for the people that has got faded yellow lines, living dead in roads. That's who I'm for, man. I ain't picking no fucking side no more. This is the fucking side I pick right here in front of me. And that's the only side I know. And they give us all these fucking labels over these years, and they make us hate each other when, we're really, when we really don't need to be hating on each other. So I just want to add that to it as well, because we got bigger fights, and we got bigger problems up ahead as Americans. And... We just need to go back to the way we used to think about things and we need to go back to conversating and having fun and actually fucking enjoying life like we fucking used to, man. I just wanted to throw that out there, man. Because I see a lot of beautiful faces, man. I see a lot of people with their kids and stuff. And this is what fucking America is about, is right here is what I'm looking at. So thank y'all. Honey suckles and rain. So so now the next one we got, this next one is about now, if you fall for something, this goes along with what I was just saying. So if you fall for something in this life, I'll, you should fall for something that's worth it. It's something you love and you'll and you'll die by. And that's what this next song is about. This is called Mind the Fall. Here we go. Make a little line right there. Orange hat, black shirt, separate people. Lift them over four people at a time, two on each side, the two people on this side of the fence. No Please. What's up, Steve? Let's make sure our fam over here is all right first. Let's go, Bubba. What's up, Steve? You doing all right, sis? Yeah. Yeah. I love y'all. Church, man! What's that say, Ty? Ty, what's that sign say, Bo? It's my dirty 30 up church. Dirty 30! Hey, actually, I want to take this time. We have, a, we have somebody we want to sing happy birthday to over here in the... Uh, where, where my outlaw family at? Where they at? If you want to come on out here, sweetie, we can sing happy birthday to you. Y'all gonna help me sing happy birthday? Yeah. We're gonna embarrass you. We're gonna sit you right up here up front, all right? What's your name, sweetie? Jaden? All right, we're gonna sing happy birthday to Jaden, y'all. You ready? Here we go. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, girl. 
Everybody over here, all right, with Gucci? All right, mine of ball. Here we go. Ooh. Find something worth falling for in life, y'all. That's all we got. Let me sing these pretty ass songs, man. I know y'all used to be being like yak, 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 all the time, so I really appreciate that. Your boy getting older. I'm finding out about taxes and shit, you know? So, kind of simmering down. <laughs> tell us, kid, tell us! By the way, man, I hope, like, if Trump does get elected, goddamn, do something about these fucking taxes, good golly. Yeah. Swear to God, we paying them bitches like three fucking times. It's like, well, what the fuck? What's going on over here with Gucci? What's that? What's that sign say, Bubba? I can't see. My name is Riley. FJB in the corner. I want to meet up church. You want to meet up church, all right? I tell you what, we'll get security. I'll hop you over in a second. And after this next song, we'll come up here. I'll get a picture with you. How about that, man? Yeah, all right, good. I got you, player. I got you, player. Now this next one, well, it might get partly cloudy a little bit. All right, hit that shit, Ty. Say 
Sit it right here for in case, because I want to throw some shit. But, how many of y'all are ready for the Creeper 3 album for real? Yeah. What y'all think about getting into the rock set already? What's up? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, well you boys got to take these damn boots off, because I can't walk in these suckers. They're brand new, so fuck that. I'm going to sign them though and give them somebody real quick. Can I get that sign? Woo! Give me that sign. Church. Also, get little get homeboy up here too, because I want to take a picture with him. But I want to say this: this is something I've been doing lately. So, I've been taking both the booths, and I've been signing both of them. I've been splitting it in the crowd and throwing them up in the air. And I've been watching on Instagram to see if each boot catcher ends up making friends with each other and hanging out outside of the show. 
So kind of like walking towards each other and making a new friendship. So we're going to try to do that again right now. Let's go, bro. So I want I want to see these two people who catch this. I want I want to see y'all become friends and just tag each other and shit. So I ain't even gonna look. I'm gonna close my eyes. Now be aware. Don't let no kids get hit by this shit. All right, here we go. Ryan, can I say something, man? Yeah, of course you can. Uh. My co-worker's here. He brought this. It's Taylorville, but it's Tylerville Day. <laughs> <laughs> this guy plucked me out of this, out of this area in January. I stopped being a carpenter. I finally get to live my dreams because this guy right here. And uh, this guy I was on the fucking roof, man. This guy's changed my life. I love you, right? Thank you, Ty. I want to say thanks to my whole band, man. We got we got my boy Ty over here on guitar. We got my girl Molly back here on drums. And we got Ethan back here on bass, man. These are three good people, man. I, I'm going to love the future of doing these shows with them. And I'm going to tell you this, man. Creeker 3 is going to be a while, son. Well, with that being said, let's get this mug off. We're going to do this next, and then I'm going to get a picture with little man. But we're gonna get into some rock shit because I'm feeling the vibe now, baby. I don't know about y'all, but I am. Let's go, Dixon yeah. yeah. This next one is called Alcoholic Shrink. Hey, can I take a picture with your baby?
Throw some of this out right quick while he gets up here. Bro, Todd, do your thing like you do in the bush, bro. Just play some random ass shit while I sit here and throw these. Hopefully somebody record that, because that's what it's sick. We got yeah. it, church. We got it. My man, it. he said, we yeah. got it, cuz. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Now, y'all want some more rock music? Yeah. This next one has cost T-Dot right. to hit my right. management up and be like, can you tell the kids to stop stealing the concrete roads? Yeah, concrete roads. <laughs> and I said, delete email like Hillary Clinton. I don't know nothing. Because you know why? Because that's what we did when we were kids, man. It ain't nothing but a street sign. If, if, if the government's got their panties in a bunch, I think kids still on a street sign is way less, way, way, way less bad than the shit they could be doing. So, fuck it, it's a street sign. Put it back up. This is called Pop Creek Road. Oh.
spotlight right there for me. Hey, grab them. I know we might be some animals, but we the best kind of animals there is out here in this field tonight. Get that shit.
Uh, come on. You Are fucking you sure?